Canva is one of the most popular graphic design tools used by people around the world. When I started learning about graphic design, the first tool I picked was Canva itself. And in this video, I want to talk about seven unknown tips and tricks about Canva that you must know and try today itself. Make sure that you watch till the end because the seventh tip is going to blow your mind away. Hi everyone, I'm Ishan Sharma. Let's have a look at these tips and tricks. Number one is going to be the ability to convert text to images with the help of Canva. Let me show you exactly how that works. You can download the app or you can directly go to canva.com and you can start using it. We can scroll down, we can go on to apps, you can open any project and you can click on text to image. And then I can give any text description about the image that I want and it will generate it for me right in front of me. So I can say horse running on water, right? In the middle of a desert random description about anything it will take some time and it will generate exact images of what you have asked so it took some time and here are the results of what we got we get so these are the four images that the ai came up with these look pretty interesting first of all you have the horse which is running on water and then you have the desert feel as well it's not completely accurate again you have to be more precise with the description and then you can just click on this image and you can start using it on your design if you want to again you can go crazy with it you can ask it anything and it will design it for you with the help of ai tip number two is the fact that you can also edit videos with the help of canva a lot of you would have been using it for making posters thumbnails you know infographics and all that but you can also create videos you can edit videos with the help of canva let me show you how that works we are on the main screen i can click on video and i can click on create a blank video template on canva and i can start putting in text i can start putting in images i can start putting in audio and i can then attach it in this timeline that you can see below right so i can just go on to elements and I can search for anything. So let's just say I search for blockchain and I can start attaching those photos, some videos if I want to, and I can change the size. You can do whatever you want, as you all know, with the help of Canva right here. So that's the power that you have with Canva, right? That's pretty much how this works. You can also trim it if you want to. You can then attach the next thing, which could be, let's just say a photo. There are a ton of options that you can explore with the help of this edit feature. You can add your own video, you can add your own audio, you can add pictures, you can add logos, you can add text, you can animate that text. The sky is the limit with the help of Canva video editing. Canva trick number three is that you can now make websites with the help of Canva as well. It is pretty interesting. You can just click on the website icon and you can click on a business or a portfolio website. When you do that, it will generate these templates that you can use or you can develop your own website as well. You can add buttons, you can add all of the functionality and then you can add URLs for where do you want this button to direct to, right? Do you want it to go to the next page or do you want it to go to a specific URL? You can attach all of that. Just to give you an example of what I'm saying, let's just say we take a look at this page right here and I can say apply all six pages and this is what we get at the end of it, right? So as you can see, this is the get in touch button. Now what I can do here is that I can attach an email over here. So as you can see, I can link stuff. So I can just say, you know, mail to and I can add the me email. So let's just say ishan at the rate marketup.in and this now becomes my mail. So when anyone will now click on this link, they will have to send me an email to get in touch with me. Again, you can change this text, you can make it your own, you can change the colors. And once you are done with the formatting of this website, you can just click on publish website, this option right here. So we'll just click here and it will ask us, how would you like to do it? We want a free domain, we want with navigation and we can now click on go this will take some time and now we can publish it right here so that is how easy it is for you to generate websites 
if you have your own business if you have your own brand or if you just want to make a simple portfolio website it is now possible all thanks to canva so this website is live i can click on view website and this is what the website looks like right now also if i click this get in touch button it will get me to the mailing service so that is essentially how this works you can put whatever link you want to it as you can see this looks very professional and i think this is a great way to get started if you want to build your own portfolio but you are not quite sure about how to configure dns and all of that how do you get your website up and running forget about all of this and just use the canva website feature tip number four is what i have just pointed out right now that you can just go to the styles and you can alter the look and feel of this whole design not just the colors but also the text the font family the font size and how it really appears I'll just show you a quick example so we can click on this and it will completely alter it right I'll click on shuffle and you can see the design changing right here right so that's essentially how this works again you can go on to the next page as well and you can implement the same design right here as well so that is the power that you have with these color palettes. You don't need to be a design genius to know what looks good. You can just come to this color palette and you can decide what feels better, right? So you can keep shuffling until you get to the point where you love this design. I hope you're liking this video so far. If you are, make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel as well. Moving on, let's talk about the trick number five which is the fact that you can now create charts. You can now make full blown charts with the help of Canva as well. If I were to add another page, I can add any of these charts that I want to, right? Now, these are not just some random charts. You can actually add values on these charts. You can edit these charts. If you want these rectangles to be round, then you can, you can change their you know, border radius, if, if I may, right? You can do this. You can also increase the column spacing if you want to do that. Or if you want to put in your own digits, your own numbers, you can add that as well, right? So that is essentially how this works. You can look into the settings and you can create full blown charts with the help of Canva as well. Trick number six is that you can now present and record your screen when you are trying to explain something with the help of Canva itself. You don't need to install OBS. You don't need to use any other software. If you have designed a PPT and you want to explain that to someone, you don't need to have any other software. You can do it right then and there with the help of Canva itself. Simply go on to share and click on to more and just go over here and click on present. Now, when you click on present and record, what happens is that it records your face while you're speaking and it records the screen at the same time. So there'll be a little bubble at the, at the bottom right or left corner and you can explain what this presentation is all about. So if I were to click on present and record, then I can go to the record studio and I can start recording it right then and there. So that is how this basically works. I will have to allow certain things, but once I do that, this is what it looks like to me right now. I can now create a simple presentation showing what this website is basically about. I can change the pages and I can explain further as well. And I can now click on end recording as well. So that is how easy it is for you to record a simple video explaining your presentation that you've just made with the help of Canva. Now I want to show you the last and the most mind blowing trick of Canva. Do you know that there are certain codes that you can enter in the elements tab? If I were to go on to elements, I can add certain codes or certain words that will give me some really interesting designs. For example, I can say 3D hand and I were to do that, I can see all of these 3D illustrations that I can use in my, in my design. If I want to use this thumbs up icon, I can use it right here. I can easily use designs like this. I can add as many as I want right here as well. When you search for this code right here, you will get all of these graphics of fruits and some green leafy vegetables as well that you can see right here. And you can then use it in, the, in your design if you want to. With this code right here, you will get human illustrations, right? So this person who is in a suit or you can get this person who is having this 
this telephone or you can move down you can find other examples of this as well just by having this code word into this elements ka tab this is another code for 3d designs that you can see right here right here is a laptop here is a person experiencing virtual reality here is one more code word when you will enter this you will get all of these designs you can get a cake you can get all of these icons in 3d and you can just scroll down and you can get more of these over here as well here's a bank here is an igloo and the list just goes on and on as you can see right here i think this is amazing that you can unlock all of these interesting uh, 3d designs with the help of just these cheat codes on the elements tab one more code that you can enter you can also enter this code and get these human looking 3d designs right so you can have this person you can have this ma'am you can have more options as you can see someone calling someone showing his phone and this just goes on and on right you can design your own website with this you can do all sorts of things you can make posters and what not right there is a huge list of these 3d designs for humans again i will put all of these codes in the description so that you can have a look at it and you can start using it on your own canva design and that is pretty much it from this video these were the seven canva tips and tricks that you must try today itself go try these out yourself i hope it helps make sure that you share this video with a friend of yours if you have any questions about canva let me know in the description as well i have made a canva tutorial as well that you can have a look at if you're interested that it would be linked over here or somewhere over here let me know if you have any other questions you can follow me on social at ishan sharma 790 and i will see you all in the next video make sure that you hit the like button and subscribe as well bye bye